Hi, I'm Curly, and welcome to Curly's Clips. So you're probably wondering what is down and what makes Marmot Down so special. Well, once again, I've got the mound renowned, the wizard of down, Randy Veneers, to help us figure this out. <laughs> come on, come on in, we're testing down. Here we are in our down conditioning and testing lab. What you can see in back of me are the cages where the down is conditioned over a period of time before it's tested. Now, probably asking yourself, well, what is down? And down's essentially the fluffy undercoating of waterfowl, particularly geese and ducks. It's what keeps the geese and ducks warm when they're floating around on the cold water out in the ponds and streams. Now, all the down that we use are, is a byproduct of the meat industry. The geese are raised for food, and the down is collected um, as the geese are processed, processed for the food industry. What makes marmot down the best? First of all, it starts off with the raw materials. So we look for high quality material from around the world, for mature birds that will give us good large down clusters and strength and durability. Next is the processing. Processing is ultimately the key point in the life of the down. The processing has to be done in a way that doesn't damage the down. It has to get washed at the right temperature and the right wash loads, dried so it doesn't over dry the down, and then packaged and shipped so everything maintains its loft. The next step is quality assurance. All Marmot Down is independently tested for content, cleanliness, and fill power. Secondarily, when the down arrives here at Marmot, we go through another phase of testing to make sure that what we get is what we order. One of the first things we do is actually take a physical look at the down. We're looking for large clusters. We're looking for very little content of fiber, which doesn't add anything to the loft. And we're also looking to make sure that the feather content is real low. Because as you can see, down clusters are three-dimensional, but feathers are flat. You need a certain amount of feathers to support the down, but you definitely don't want too much. So as I mentioned, all marmot down is independently tested, and we don't stop there. We test it a second time once it gets through our doors. And I'm sure all of you are curious about how down is tested for fill power. Here we have the standard uh, tube, which is graded for cubic inches. Inside the tube goes one ounce of down. As you can see, down is a very fluid medium. One ounce of down can be lofted high or it can be lofted low. So to standardize the test, a 63 gram weight is placed on top of the down and allowed to compress it down to a certain level to get a consistent fill power rating for all test methods and all laboratories. So as we can see after one minute, the cylinder has rested at approximately 860 cubic inches per ounce. So our guarantee to you is a minimum fill power. There's no plus or minus. If we say 850, it's going to be 850 or higher. Many times, 860 or even higher than that. Well, thanks to Randy Verniers, our wizard of down. Appreciate all the helpful info. I'd say it's about time to get the flock out of here. <laughs>